Hey everyone, if you have rare US and world coins you want to sell, watch this video till the end and I'll show you where you can post them for sale. This is impressively struck 1961D Jefferson Nickel in MS64 plus condition with full steps. Exceptionally well struck for a 1960s Jefferson Nickel, this important near gem also offers bright satin luster, fully untoned and highly appealing. For most dates in the Jefferson Nickel series, the pursuit of perfection boils down in many instances to the number of the steps visible on the porch of Monticello on the rivers, and not so great. Indeed many dates may have listing of MS67 or other lofty grades, but full step specimens are very rare even below MS65 condition. This superb gem in MS64 condition ended up selling for $16,450 at Stax Bowers auction. Here is 1971D Kennedy half dollar struck on a 40% silver planchet, circulated half dollar in AU58 condition. This wrong planchet error coin weighs 11.59 grams. An issue that was produced using the then new copper nickel clad composition struck on a 40% silver planchet in error. As a demo mint used that composition for its 1970D half dollar issue, this planchet was obviously left over from the preceding year's coinage. Boldly struck with satiny luster, both sides exhibit only the lightest suggestions of funning to otherwise silver grey surfaces, exceedingly rare and of great significance to advanced mint error enthusiasts. It was sold for $9,900 at Stax Bowers auction. Here is 1960D Lincoln Sand with large date, graded in mint state 67 red by PCGS. Delightful rose red luster dominates the outward appearance of this coin, although we do note blushes of pale gold tinting in isolated areas of the rims. A fully struck satin textured superb gem with nary a detracting blemish to report. Nearly unique was MS67 red grade from PCGS, sold for $8,050 at Stax Bowers auction. Here is 2000p Jefferson Nickel in MS65 red condition, error 5 cents struck on a 2000 Lincoln cent, so called double denomination coin. The present lot confirms that the Philadelphia Mint was equally susceptible to inadvertently producing 6 cent pieces during the millennial year. This full red gem shows a bold scent date on the nifty location of the bridge of Jefferson's nose, as if the scent date was a pair of reading glasses. The nickel date and the mint mark are virtually complete. Lincoln is nearly vertical related to Jefferson, and both presidents gaze west. It ended up selling for $3,120 in 2023. This is 1965 Kennedy half dollar with deep obverse die cap. This is an intriguing mint error, rare as certified, and perhaps even rarer if determined that it was struck from the SMS dies. The grade on the NGC insert identifies this obverse die cap as having been produced from circulation struck dies, and while that is how this coin is shown here, the obverse impression is not all that dissimilar to what one would expect to see in special mint set Kennedy of dollar from 1965 to 1967 era. The field is bright and semi-reflective. The design elements fully rendered was set into mostly semi-reflective finish. It was sold for $7,200 at Stax Bowers auction. Thanks for watching guys, like, subscribe and comment. Stay 